Hi there, it's Candles for Assange going out live from New Zealand. Um, we've got a big day tomorrow. Um, it's, well, it's today now in New Zealand already. Saturday 11th of April marks um, one year since Julian Assange was arrested unlawfully um, from the Ecuadorian Embassy in London. Um, tomorrow there's a virtual march going on, the world's first virtual march. Um, it's currently um, two in USA, two in U UK, one in New Zealand and one in England. Um, there are online protests going on um, basically for the next 40, 48 hours. And I believe that Australians for Assange have already started or they will be starting the next hour or so um, on Facebook. So get into that Facebook group. If you want to check out any of the details or links, you can go and look out on Twitter, Candles for Assange. Um, so the virtual march is going to start off in Australia, in Sydney, um, and we have a bunch of uh, speakers including Doctors for Assange, Lisa Johnson, um, and we have Andrew from Action for Assange speaking as well with Ian Rose at um, Support Assange and WikiLeaks Coalition in Sydney. Um, and that starts at 10.30 in the morning in Australian time, which is UTC plus 10. Um, and then New Zealand, we will be doing a, um, a Zoom meeting tomorrow where we'll be sending out the link and allowing anyone they want to come and join us on an open mic. Um, we have the wonderful Patrick from um, Germany who has been responsible for um, getting the weekly protests off the ground for Candles for Assange, which ended up with um, 35 cities in the end um, holding regular events. Um, which is amazing work, particularly that 25 of them were in Germany. So thanks to Patrick, the, a huge amount of work has been done around the world. Um, so Patrick's going to join us and so is Joe Booth, who's joining me now on Zoom. And that will be at 7 p.m. New Zealand time. Um, so UTC plus 12 in New Zealand. Um, that's about the other opposite end of the day from the UK. Um, in the USA, there is Courage Foundation, who are doing a massive online event, um, and they have got people like Chris Hedges and Daniel Ellsberg and um, Aaron Mate, wonderful lineup there. Um, go and have a look at Courage Foundation for more information. Um, that is one uh, 3 o'clock UTC minus 5, which is Eastern Standard Time in America. Um, and at one o'clock, Action for Assange will be doing their live stream vigil as well. And so you'll get Steve from Slow News Day um, and Taylor Hudak and Andrew Zigland um, and all the people there at Action for Assange who've been um, such a wonderful support. Um, and last but not least, chronologically, um, we get to UK because it's on at 5.30 p.m. Um, and that is UTC zero, uh, otherwise Greenwich Mean Time. And that is being organized by Deeper Driver on Twitter. And if you look up Free the Truth, um, the conference there, 5.30, you've got Stefan Amaritzi, Peter Osborne, Chris Williamson, uh, Kristen Heffernson, and Andrew Feinstein. Um, so wonderful lineup, lots of things going on all day. Um, and New Zealand, we're going to be having our own a little uh, Candles for Assange, Free Assange New Zealand um, online protest and we'd love as many of you as we can to um, come and join us um, and if you like you can be a participant and join us on Facebook on Free Assange New Zealand or you can look at it where we'll have a watch party on Candles for Assange and hopefully we'll have Periscope working as well on Twitter if we've got it all sorted and that would be sorted thanks to Joe Booth who is sitting here with me now um, and I'm going to see if I've got the technology to change it over, or can you do that now, Joe? Um, I can just start talking. And Yay, yeah, and I'll switch you screen. over. Um, we've, yeah. been, uh, we've been sussing out a bit of tech for this um, this evening, and it's it's cool to get it going, and it's fantastic to see we have, um, oh, we have probably about 10 viewers, and there's about five hanging off your Facebook at the moment, um, so awesome to, awesome to see. We'll be live um, Properly at, as you're saying, um, seven o'clock tonight, um, 1900, um, which is in about 17 hours. <laughs> <laughs> Crikey! Um, so we we've got a sleep. day, a day of um, a day of watching the rest of the world uh, as well. So there's there's 
clearly happening for this uh, Free Assange um, evacuate of Assange, and certainly he's in Belmarsh and he's, he's not getting any better. He's, he's, that's horrifying, really, that he's still there. Um, and they won't even let him out for uh, COVID because there's no charge, there's no reason to hold him. <laughs> so they have no reason to let him go. Um, this, this, this is you know, shocking stuff. So um, certainly we're, we're in support of it and I'm, I'm doing my bit. I'm mostly on the tech side. I'm a technical guy, but uh, we're good at this as well. So it's awesome. And thanks, Alex, for um, you know, organising this and keeping keeping everything aflame, um, Candles for Assange, and making it making it all work across the world. Awesome effort there. <laughs> thanks, Joe. Brilliant. Well, um, well, really hope that we see a whole bunch of you tomorrow. Um, and we've got Fiona Hansen from Auckland. Um, we have Craig Tuck, um, lawyer that has been working with Julian Assange and also um, a friend of Julian Assange and has also supported Susie Dawson. And hopefully we might have a few surprise names as well turning up on our live stream. I've invited a lot of people, but only very last minute. Um, okay, so I think we will sign off until tomorrow, Joe, yeah? Oh, you've, you've muted yourself. Um, We've got to learn how to talk. One, one um, comment from um, the audience um, is that we've got a bit of an echo. Echo. Um, do you want to just see um, the bottom of one of the two um, things that we had on on there, the microphone one on on OBS? Can you see if you can mute that and just see if that gets rid of the echo? The mic aux. Um, yeah, mute that, and hopefully that will sort out our echo. And the, yeah, so no, 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 no. It's well, I don't know, prosperity. This was um, sort of a, a test, but we'll, we'll view the video. It won't be too laggy. Cool. Um, so yeah, yeah. So mute the mic off because essentially that's doing it twice. And hopefully it will work. Uh, mute it. Um, Victor, is that? Yeah, Victor, is that working now? Um, hopefully that's working. Yeah, go for it. That's always fun. Um, yeah, I think possibly that you've pinned this video by clicking on it. Um, so just um, up in the shop and go unpin or something. Yeah. I...
Oh, thanks. Awesome. Or we can turn off soon and um, show them our lovely image again. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks for putting up with us. <laughs> <laughs>